All right, guys, welcome back to another video. This one's going to be good. This one's going to be special. It's the Bucks offensive tackle in his second year. Sorry, third year this year. Fuck it. Tell you what, time really does fly, doesn't it? Time does fly. Anyway, came into the league as a rookie in 2020. Went to the Bucks. Um, blocked for the, the great Tom Brady, the greatest of all time. And, uh, you know, got a Super Bowl ring. So the man is a Super Bowl winner. Uh, the Bucks, unfortunately, didn't make it to the big dance last year, but they were close. And, uh, look, I just love this guy. I love his attitude. I love the fact that he's so young and he's so big. And, uh, you know, he's, he seems so kind. And, uh, look, at the end of the day, he's come in at number 41 on the list of the top 100 players in 2022. Pretty sure he came in, in like, the 90s or the 80s last year. Um which was to be expected after, you know, winning a Super Bowl, etc. Anyways, guys, this should be good. I'm backing the Bucks this year. I'm backing them to do it again. So with that in mind, I'm backing Tristan Wirfs to do it again. Let's go. Freak athlete. You know, he hang clean, 400 pounds. Yeah, I remember seeing that. I remember seeing that. He's a freak athlete. Not only did he do that, but he can jump out of a fucking pool onto the side without using his hands. Actually, no, no, maybe that was someone else. But what he can do is box jump a ridiculous amount of height with a ridiculous amount of weight in his hands. That's not the kind of guy that you want to try and get past. I feel like I've seen him do a backflip. can jump out of a pool. Yeah, I saw that. Everywhere I go. I go, oh, bro. Right? You try and do that. Boys, you, you try and do that. Pool. I was like... I was like, yeah, I didn't think it was like that big of a deal. Oh, it's a big deal, mate. It's a bi I think I've seen this That's one. I've seen it. I tried to do it, but I messed up my shin. No one. Yeah, no shit. You messed up your shin, bro. No one can do that. That's insane. That is so fucking... That's just... i got no words for that. I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Harder than it looks eventually able to do so but not on the first try like i'll give you that impressive you telling me cam you, ca sorry camera you're telling me you could do that i don't buy it show me a video hey keep showing you the best in the league baby i'm really a big fan of his game I, I see a lot of myself when i look at him absolutely absolutely but what i can't tell you is how this guy still looks so young at the age he is. He continues to take these huge progressive steps. Good Latest. block from the all-pro Tristan Wirfs, their right tackle. He's strong. <laughs> See Tristan Wirfs out here on the perimeter against Aziz Ojolari. He throws into the ground like you're supposed to. <laughs> That's a great Oh, one. man. And he's really athletic. They're going to have Gronk block down and get the athletic Wirfs outside and around. Great block on the edge by Wirth. Longest play of the game, a 30-yard romp by Rojo. And, I mean, that is, that's textbook. He's just, <laughs> he's just great position. He's always in great position as a pass protector. Wirth's attributes his superb technique to his background as a wrestler. Oh, mate. Well, I hope Mike Daniels has got something to say. There's just so much that can transfer from the wrestling room onto the football field. Leverage, using your hands. Spatial awareness, just being able to trust your body and be able to keep your balance in, in certain scenarios, I think, is really beneficial. Oh. Bruh. Go, boys. Got to get aggressive and go fight him, all right? Yep. Okay. It's not... Okay, I'll tell you this right here, right now. It is not normal for a human being to be that size to be able to move in the way that he can. It's it's not normal. So it's actually... It's not fathomable. You, you Like... Normal human beings like myself, our, us mere mortals, we, we, we can't, we actually can't um, fathom it. Little advice from Tom Brady has also contributed to work success. The first thing he told me my rookie year was, don't get beat fast and don't get beat inside. And he said, we'll be all right if you don't do those two things. Okay, don't get beat fast, which means don't push yourself up too fast and don't get beat on the inside. Because at the end of the day, if you get beat on the outside, I'm going up the middle. I was like, sounds good. Sweet, In two bro. years, Wurfs has only allowed three sacks. 
which has enabled the GOAT to continue his assault nah, on the sure. record book. Oh, Wirfs was a massive, massive uh, part of that Super Bowl run, for sure. 600 touchdown passes for Tom Brady. It's hard get to on the protect inside. the pocket pass, especially a Tom Brady type, because not too many people Tom can outrun. <laughs> Dude, my belly ain't looking good in this. You look <laughs> Like he's going up against some of the best defensive linemen in the league and like stopping them in their tracks. He got a um, murderous rope in his division, Carolina and the Saints. Some of the best edge guys in the league. Him and Cam Jordan going at it. Those matchups are pretty intense. He even managed to get revenge on Khalil Mack after he schooled Wurfs during his rookie year. After Khalil tossed me the whole year, people tagged me on Instagram, Twitter, messaging me the video. I had been thinking about it all year and I circled on my calendar. I did a lot better that game. Just the improvement I've made, that's what I've been proud of. Don't get beat fast, and don't get beat on the inside. The offensive line has been really good yeah. for Tom Brady. He's a really good dude. Always upbeat. Kind of like a big kid, man. Mom! You're a freak! You're a freak! You're a freak! He's a freak! He's very humble. Let's do it. What do you say, boys? Yeah, I feel that. Because of that, he's always open to learning. I think he wants to be great. Feel the that. way he works and how much he cares about his teammates. I don't see how you can not love Tristan Wirfs. He swans through the... Oh, okay. I'll tell you what. Right here, right now. i got some real goosebumps. i got some real goosebumps. And uh, I reckon that's probably the sixth time we've, we've had that happen thus far. And they're not going away. Oh, my God. This is one of these, these rushes. Oh, my God. Bruh. Oh, go away, please. The reason they're still continuing is because I, I keep I keep uh, replaying what what uh, Chris Godwin just said. How can you not like Tristan Wirfs? That's the thing. He's just kind of scratching the surface of what he can do, and I think he could be like one of the best tackles in the league for ten plus years. Let's go! Let's, I can't yep. jump that high. Uh. Wait a Tell you what, that, that, that video was over too soon. I've still got goosebumps, and I'm going to leave it there. Do we need to look up his stats? No, we don't. He's, no, nah. This is one video where I feel like I've said enough. I feel like they've said enough, and I feel like all we need to do is wish him the best of luck this coming year, and uh, go Bucks. See you guys. In the next one, we're looking at Justin Herbert, the QB for the Chargers. Previous year, he was Offensive Rookie of the Year, and now lands himself at number 40 on the list. All right, see you soon.